guys, всем привет! Welcome to Alice Yummy Food. Today I'm gonna show you an incredible cheesecake recipe. This is a no-bake orange and chocolate cheesecake. And it's actually quite a healthy cheesecake as well. So if you're watching your diet, this is the perfect cheesecake for you. The combination works so well. You've got chocolate and orange and then topped with more chocolate sauce on top with my chocolate truffles. So yeah, as you can guess, this is a pretty chocolate cake. I hope you enjoyed, let's get started. We are going to need ripe avocados, cashew nuts that have been soaking overnight, dates, walnuts, oranges, vanilla extract, maple syrup, honey, cocoa powder and some coconut virgin oil. We are going to start with making our chocolate base, add your nuts in a food process and blitz away. Then add your dates, make sure they're soft and then add your cocoa powder, maple syrup and blitz again until it's nice and smooth. Then we're going to add our coconut oil and mix everything together. The mixture should be nice and sticky and soft just like that. Add your chocolate base into your pan and press it down so it's nice and smooth. Next we're going to make our orange cheesecake layers, so zest and juice your oranges. Place cashew nuts into a food processor along with your maple syrup, then add a pinch of salt and orange juice, and lastly coconut oil. Mix everything together until it's nice and smooth. Then add your orange zest and mix again. Pour your cheesecake layer on top of your chocolate brownie mixture and place it into the freezer for about 15 to 20 minutes. Next we're going to make our chocolate mousse layer. So cut your avocados in half, take out the seed and then scoop out the mixture using your spoon. You should use ripe avocados for this. Then add your avocados into a blender together with some coconut oil and maple syrup and lastly add your cocoa powder. Mix everything together until it becomes nice and chocolatey. Take your cake out of the freezer, make sure it's nice and set and then add your chocolate mousse layer on top and spread your chocolate mousse around the cake. Then place it into the freezer for 20 to 30 minutes or best to leave it overnight Lastly, we're going to make our chocolate sauce. In a bowl, add your melted coconut oil together with maple syrup and mix that together. Then add your cocoa powder and make sure it's all nice and mixed. Then decorate your cake the way you like it. I like to spread the chocolate sauce around the cake. Then add some coconut shreds around for color. And of course, I'm going to add my homemade chocolate truffles. If you want to know how to make them, then you can watch the video just below I will put the link in my description box enjoy the cake it's delicious and yummy thank you so much for spending time with me in my kitchen guys I hope you enjoyed this video don't forget to subscribe and give us a big thumbs up Yay! <laughs> and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!